Hello guys, it's your boy Flame Ninja today with a another stream. Hope you lot have been doing well. I've been doing pretty well myself. Sorry for all the mic bumping. But yes, uh today, yeah, we're gonna be continuing Psychonauts. Um I guess the first thing I can cover is I am fine now. Of course, last stream I was a bit, you know, groggy. I was a bit off because uh, I'd just taken my second COVID uh, shot. Uh, so I uh, very much was dealing with the side effects of that and I was just fucked up. Um, but yeah, pretty much the day after that day, I was completely recovered. Don't know how that fucking works. Like one day I feel like a truck had hit me and then the next day I was like, oh, I'm completely fine and felt incredibly energized and stuff. Yeah, it was for some reason, the day after my illness, I felt better than I normally do in terms... It might have just been, like, shit like my body naturally producing steroids and adrenaline and stuff to deal with the disease. But I felt fucking fantastic the day after uh, I felt completely shit from the um, vaccination. Like, holy shit. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, no... Uh, so today, we'll be doing a full stream, of course, for Psychonauts. I might even be able to finish the game, because, uh, I didn't watch the video, but I saw, like, a speedrun of Psychonauts. I saw up to the point I got to, and there was only, like, 20 or 10 minutes left to the speedrun, implying that there's only, like, a few more missions to go. So, that, no, we might be actually near the end, but, um, yes, we'll be playing that, and if we do finish it, we do finish it. Uh, after Psychonaut, I'm not entirely sure. One of my friends, uh, threw an, I, I say threw an idea at me. It was just something he mentioned. It, it, yeah, he did throw an idea at me, essentially. Um, which I might do, now that I think about it. Because I think it would be a fine game to do. Because, of course, I want to play one of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force games. But I'm not going to save that until after the next game, I feel. Uh, because, of course, Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force games, they're quite long. And I did I did one not too long ago. So, uh, we're probably going to save that for either after the next one. Or potentially after the next next one. All I know is that no matter what playthrough I'm doing, when Elden Ring releases, we are stopping that playthrough. And I'm just going to play through Elden Ring. Uh, and then probably return afterwards. Uh, if it's a game I enjoy, I'll return. If it's a game I'm sort of half and half on. Uh, but the game that he uh, suggested was uh, Witcher 3, which at first, uh, and again, it's, I feel like it might be fine for streaming. The game is like 90% cutscenes from what I remember. It's very cutscene heavy, but I've been playing FF14, so that's not much to say. Um, but the first time I played Witcher 3, uh, I was like, eh, not really feeling it. Uh, so I feel like giving it a try again might be good. Uh, and I feel like playing on stream would be a lot better, because of course on stream... Uh, it, it sort of gives me that, uh, the, the push to play games, you know, um, so like pl playing Witcher 3 on stream, it'll essentially push me to actually play and progress it rather than in my own time. I always, like, I started The Witcher 3 and then when I went back to play it, I was just like, I don't feel like playing it. Uh, so I feel like streaming it might be better. Uh, I might do some Monster Hunter World Iceborne if I can actually stream that well, because I don't know if the quality is good enough or anything. Um... Because that's another thing I like have that feeling of I want to play for it, but I want to focus on other games in my own time, especially at the moment because I'm focusing on FF14 a lot at the moment, and we'll be talking about that this stream because I got to a pretty fucking good bit. Um, other than that, I'm not really sure about what I could stream as like a next full game. There are some short playthroughs I could do. There are some, like, one-offs, like Balloon's Tower Defense, which I've been playing quite a bit of. Uh, Balloon's Tower Defense 6 is sort of my, like... Balloon's Tower Defense 6 has sort of been my game where I just play a short bit of in between my FF14, like, big play things. Because it gives me those little breaks to essentially get some fresh air after playing FF14. Um, to play the next Star Wars game, LEGO Star Wars game, LEGO Star Wars 3, Dark Souls 2... Uh, it's always a game. It's a game that exists, uh, and that's all I can say about it. Um, hmm. I right, think of many other playthroughs. Fallout 2 or something? Um, I don't play through Fallout, I'm gonna be honest, the original ones. Uh, my god, are they boring? I've got some games I probably could play through, but none that are really, you know 
popping out to me at the moment. Uh, so, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll have thinks about that. I was going to play the New World Open Beta, not on stream, but in my own time. But by the time I realized, oh, wait, this is a thing, uh, it was pretty much over. <laughs> uh, it, it started on the 9th and I only realized yesterday, oh, this is a thing. So I essentially, I, I just didn't bother because it's like a 39 gig download for a day of playing. Uh, so I just was like, yeah, fuck it. We're just going to ignore that. Um, but yes, let's just get into Psychonauts, I guess, then, instead of uh, just constantly uh, blabbering about stuff. Uh, where's my game? There it is. Right. Uh, last time we had a short stream, because I was dead, um, where we went to the painting. Oh, wait, we actually turned on the game audio. Hold on. We went to the guy who did painting, and we dealt with his, like, inner problems so now he could paint and we got a painting which we can probably give to the guy guarding the elevator to the dentist yep. right so uh let's yeah let's just fucking yeet in i guess Whee! right where are we exactly right we're in the little asylum bit and I have the picture, and I wonder if this will allow me through. Up to the secret laboratory, then, is it? One moment. You're not Dr. Laboto. Oh. My eyes may be half gone, but I would recognize the mad doctor anywhere. He's got Are you a sure? stone cold face. A man doesn't easily forget. He wears a beastly smock covered in thick straps like an electric chair. And in the place where his hand should be. Oh, okay, so I need to gather all the things. You're not Dr. Roboto. You don't pay my salary, so kindly back away from my elevator and die. Thank you, sir. Okay, so I need straps. Well, I've got the claw. Greetings. If I may say so, your claw is the one man. If you're... What happened? Where's your... You in... Rappy jacket. Good day. So I need to get a jacket from somewhere. Oh, I have a jacket. Oh, and then I need the face feature. What would be the face feature? That's... Nah, that's not going to help. Don't have anything for the glasses, do I? Find a claw for the costume. Oh, wait, we got the objectives, and it's going to tell me all the different things. Oh, wait, that that might actually Greetings, work. Dr. Lobotto. Good to see your face. True. I wearing your favorite jacket. Oh. When I say so, your claw is looking especially menacing today. Up to the secret laboratory, then, is it? Oh, that that worked. <laughs> I already had anything, everything, so that was pretty much. This time, eh, Doctor? Less work for me. Inmate yeah. Whitehead. Chief Orderly Bond. Oh, he just fucking chases after him, Jesus. Well, here I am. Up in the tower of an abandoned insane asylum. Wearing a straitjacket. Probably a joke. Yeah. With the disguise. Yeah, yeah. Or I should throw that away. <laughs> here we go. Sure, that was, that was one interesting thing in this speed run. I don't know how to do it, but he basically, like, did, like, that. Well, but properly, which allowed him to like infinitely jump high, which was uh, basically allowed him to fly, which was really funny. I like the objectives are still uh, trying to sort themselves out, even though I've done them. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh oh. Rat spook. Okay, let's use my gun on the rat. I feel like that's a, that's a better bet. Mm -hmm. So we're actually in the proper insane asylum. This place has got some really like, well, not really creepy, but some like slightly creepy. Um. Oh, they die and release gas. Okay, when they die, they release gas. That's what was fucking me over. Um, but like, it's got some creepy ideas for areas because uh, you'd think this would be like a uh, kids game, but this is very. I actually don't know the rating of this game. I'm gonna be honest. It could be fucking 18 for all I know. But I feel like this is definitely, I feel like this has to be more of a teenager age game just because of all the like, I say references and stuff, but all of like the, um, just some of the dialogue and stuff I feel like is kind of teenager uh, rather than kid. But I don't think it's adult because there's nothing like 
an adult in this game. Except for, you know, the milkman. Because, like, the milkman does, like, Molotov a bunch of, like, kids. Um. Uh, he, like, Molotovs a bunch of people, but you never actually see anything. <laughs> like, they don't fucking burn. You see their flesh burn off and shit like that. No. It's just sort of, you know, a very slight thing. Hello. Oops, swing. Wee wee. Place is quite fucky. It's quite a uh, interesting area to explore. That would actually be a really weird game, like a 3D platformer horror game. Oh wait, yeah, little nightmares exist. I mean, a 3D platformer with platforming. A uh, little nightmare is a platformer, but it's a, it's one of those because it's a horror game. They went for very like clunky, slow. Very deliberate platforming, not platforming like this where you're doing fucking double jumps and prompt flips everywhere. I feel like that would be quite an interesting and difficult game to make. Uh, I mean, Hand Time nearly did it essentially with the little, um, with, uh, Baron Von, whatever the fuck's, uh, mansion. That was a, that was slightly horror esque, I feel, which was, a uh, quite interesting, honestly. It was definitely weird, to say the least. This way. I heard you. <gasps> I see you. All right, get just get the heels without entering the fucking death smoke. <laughs> Hat in time was really fucking good, to be fair. Hat in time is, is is really fucking good. I honestly feel like I enjoyed it more than uh, Odyssey. Odyssey, of course, has I feel like has the better platforming and stuff. Um, but I like the Hat in Time's environment, the humor. Like it had the better like humor and stuff. It's I guess Hat in Time's kind of just like a, a again. It's it's very much like Psychonauts, where yes, it doesn't have the best platforming, but the humor, the environments and stuff make up for all of that. Can I not break the window? Surely I can break a window. Wow, I cannot break a window. Oh, do I just have to go upwards? Because there are things to swing off of. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wait, can I jump up there? Oh, yeah, of course I can jump up there. I have a fucking super jump. Which goes higher than my double jump. Back, let's get back up there quickly. Oh, wow, you can actually use that to, like, get a cheeky extra bit of air. I did not realize that. So if you double double jump, that that actually slightly brings you up. That does work. Okay, that's actually quite interesting. As like a little thing. Ooh, that's some little. Oh, oh I'm just not gonna move because if I move, I'm gonna walk straight off the fucking edge. Here we go. <laughs> hey, I want to yeet myself into the abyss below because I just don't know where I'm going. Oh, hello. Oh, oh God. <laughs> okay, we good. We good, we good. Right, let's do this. And then let's jump up. And jump up again. Okay, then. This is quite fucking spook. They could totally throw jump scares in here and this would be a horror game. But this, this is this is a uh, slightly fucky. It's also probably because this has got like old game graphics, which is why. So like, old game graphics always make things spooky because it's just like, it feels wrong and nothing like this. Like this is slightly creepy right here. Just a fucking black pitch black. Oh god, the brain's not the easiest to move around. But like, oh I see. Like a black, uh, like a very dark room with slight light. Oh god, there's one on the wall. I fucking threw a grenade. I threw a confusion grenade at the rats. That's um I don't think that's how it works. You can't confuse the confuser. I think it just keeps hiding. Oh god, that's just poison. Oh, 
Oh, literal fucking gamer. Right, I see all those rats. Okay, that's all of them. All right, now let's do the big jump. <gasps> oh. Oh, Jesus Christ, the momentum from hitting a ledge. Oh, that was another trick I saw. There was, like, a weird, like, ground pound thing you could do, where if you, like, ground pounded a certain way, you'd get, like, ah! You'd get fucking extreme amounts of, like, velocity. It was really funny. Oh, I can just walk on acid with my ball. I forget about that. I forget that the ball allows you to go on certain terrain. Oh! Go, go, go. And then we want to jump, hover. Wait, I wanted to jump and hover. Oh, why did I walk straight back into it? God fucking damn it. Oh, I hear a fucker. Right. Jump, hover. There we go. And then I probably want to go across the poles I was jumping across before I fucking gained incredible momentum and shot myself into the next dimension. No, no, no. Do this. Yeah, that's just that's just a normal platform. <gasps> oh god, I nearly flung myself off because I was trying to fucking extreme parkour. Whee! How we go? I wonder if there's like a weird speed run way to do this where you like do a weird Oh wait, you can probably just fly to the top using speedrunning technique where you just like infinite jump. Yep. Pardon me, I'm coming through. That's a lot of fucking rats, that's all I'm gonna say. Whee! Where the fuck do I go from here? Oh, I can jump off here. Doink! <laughs> okay, okay, I might be able to jump off of this onto another place. Where do I go? I need to get up there somehow so I can cross the tightrope. I don't know how, though. I just... <gasps> Ooh. I can jump up here. Oh, there's a brain. Oh, there's multiple brains on the outside. Can I just... Oh, hell yeah. Big brain. Bonk. Oh, yeah, there's probably been some brains I missed. Oh, Dogum, we actually got the fish's brain back. Took me fucking long enough. I mean, it's so small, it's not surprising it was hard to find, let's be honest. How am I meant to jump to from here? <gasps> that was very spooky. Right, what if I rotate backwards? Right. Backwards? Can I, like, jump up there? Does that count as a thing I can hook onto? No, definitely not. Um... Anything out the wind? Oh, Jesus Christ. That's a lot of rats. I do not like how many... F I They just fucking yum at you. They just fucking run at you waiting to die. Uh, Can I go out the window? <gasps> okay, don't go out the fucking window apparently. Because that just leads to your fucking demise. Good to know, game. <laughs> I thought that, I thought it'd be fine because the rats came from there, and the rats seem to be very fragile. Uh, I mean, you could probably grip onto that, but I have no idea how. Oh wait, you can jump up over here. Hold on, I could probably get onto the thing from over here. I think I need to go down. No, I just, that just bounced you back up. I'm just going to stand here because I'm not dealing with those rats. <laughs> um, oh, I can swing off of that thing, can't I? As to where that leads, I don't know. Oh, I cannot swing off of that thing. Never mind. These things explode if I'm on my ball. Uh, apparently they will, yes. I can see that she hides, meaning that this is, in theory, the right way to go. <gasps> oh my god, I, oh my god, I nearly fell all the way off to the beginning, Jesus Christ. This is uh, slightly precarious, to say the least. 
only because my brain is numb and my brain does not have any higher, you know, functions. Jump. Glide. He hides again. Oh shit, I just instant jumped without even thinking. Um... The thing is, you can jump down here, you can go down there, but what do you do once you go down there? You can go grab the brain, but there's nothing else. I can hear her. Oh, wait, can I go up there? <gasps> wait. Can I? No. No, I cannot. So let's just jump over here quickly and let me uh save the game. Uh, there. Because I've got stereo sound, but I don't know if this game was actually built for stereo sound. Because uh, audio is coming from over there, but I don't know if the audio is completely random or not. Yeah, and I, I just got to get up there, but I don't think I can actually get up there in any way possible. <gasps> oh, I, I mean, I can fall off, but that's like the only thing I can do. Hmm. Or well, how to do this here. Boy, I don't have any, like, items to get myself higher. Unless I can move the bed? Like, I hear them here. I want to jump onto the windowsill. But, okay, you can't, which is a good thing. I just look outside. She's Yeah, so she's up on the roof. And see, this allows you to swing over here, but it doesn't really give you much choice to do past here, though. Unless I can do something really cheeky and fucking glide over here. I thought that worked for a second. That would have been hilarious. I go... Right. All I can do from here is just go back and loop around there, or climb back up here. Meaning I get another attempt at my stupid idea. I wonder if I can jump up the wall if I glitch it. <gasps> oh! oh, wow. I only gained... Oh, no, no. I lost my life. Okay, good. I wanted to lose the life because I wanted to gain all my HP back. I wonder if I could just jump over there anyway. Oh, you can kind of fuck with the terrain here. Oh, wait. You can totally make that jump there. Like, that's not even... I feel like that jump is just possible. Ooh, that was close. If I get enough height, I could probably just make that jump across and not need to bother about anything else. Yeah, if I just go up here, I'll be able to skip this. Be able to just fucking make the full leap. Oh, wait, can I go from this side, maybe? Uh, no, that place is way higher. Oh, God, I didn't. Oh, I fucking pressed A by accident. Uh-oh. God damn it. All the way back down here now. Thanks to my goddamn hubris. Oh, wait. One of the things it will say is quite annoying not knowing what I can grapple onto the side of. Because some things you can, and then some things you can't. And it's very confusing. Right, okay, let's go back up here, climb back up, leap on, and then hold down the trigger and not press A. Right, so I want to simply do this, then do this, this. Easy. And then, from here we can't really do anything though. Like, I can't get up to that platform from here. I can go around there. But that means nothing. I genuinely don't think I can do that from there. I feel like I can make this cheeky little fucking uh, jump. The fact that you can go over here, though, kind of makes me just think, oh, it has to be. I can't, like, get up there. I can't get onto that rope because it's fucking hard to get to. I feel like if I just... If I Piss about the edge enough, it will allow me to. <laughs> it will allow me to run straight into the fucking void again. My God. Uh oh, hello, boy. Oh wait, I need to go past you, sir. Don't mind me. Oh wait, it's literally a brain right here. I'd even see. Yoink. 
I feel like I'm missing something very obvious. I mean, I have a bunch of powers, but I don't think any of the powers actually help in this situation. Except for maybe, like, invisibility to make it so she doesn't see me. Like, that's all I can think about. Like, I can get back up here and she'll be... Not here anymore. Like, if I were to, like... Oh, she goes up and down. She doesn't stay still. Jesus Christ, that's a lot of rats. Right, I don't see... Right, if I were to use, like... Oh, fuck. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, that. If I were to use this, would that work? No, because she hides away way before you ever even look at her. Oh, I don't have any energy. Like, and then she appears in the window. Implying that you have to go this way. But you can't. Oh my god, thank god I saved that. Because you go over here, you go up here, and then you just can't fucking go anywhere. I'm going to be honest. I just really want to grab that brain. I can totally grab that brain. I don't think I can get up to the cables. I feel like if I just fucking do that. <laughs> I, don't know if that I don't think that's what you're meant to do to get here. Actually, now that I look at it, that might have just been the only way to get over here. Oh shit, there's a thing up there as well. Nice. Oh, you can climb up. Oh, I didn't realize you could fucking just climb these cables. If I knew that, that would have been a lot easier. If I... It's because, again, the climbing stuff was never really that specific. Like, it never really tells you what you can and can't climb. It just sort of... It's a guessing game. <laughs> Well, at least I know I could probably just have climbed up something to get up here instead of needing to do my janky fucking parkour. <laughs> Yay. Crystal's brain. Crystal. I don't know who, what brains I've got left, to be fair. I haven't really counted. I don't know if I need to collect every brain to complete the game. I would think so, because surely only that would save the thing. But maybe if I defeat <gasps> the dentist, it would be like, oh, you've collected, you've defeated the dentist. Now we can just go casually collect the brains. Instead of needing to go and, um, collect everything. <sighs> Holy shit, is this precarious. Oh my god, that actually worked. Sometimes my genius is frightening. <laughs> right, now that I know I can climb up barbed wire, whatever the fuck the cable is, I would just do that. Uh, do I have to go around the edge of the building? Oh. Okay, so they're in one of these rooms, but I can't actually enter these rooms from... Oh, wait. I can uh, telekinesis the chair out of the way. Aha! That is something I, would have, uh, I wouldn't have put together. <laughs> okay, I can go up here. Okay. Okay. This is a... This is a lot of parkour, I'll say that. Can I climb on this? No. Oh, but can I skate? Oh, hello. What the fuck am I meant to do to get up there? Uh, I mean, I can skate around, which probably goes around the edge of the building. Big brain. I can climb up this, yes. That. Grab that, nice. Making some good progress upwards. Let's save, though, in case I fucking fall into the abyss. Because I, I know, knowing my brain, I'm going to, like... I'm just going to be like, oh, I can make that jump, as you've seen multiple times, and then just fuck it up. Oh, it's an old lady. Oh. That's a threat. bit rude, but I will quickly take a break to do something quickly. Just go very quickly do something, because my body needs a pit.
Right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Just had to take a quick one. Because I, I have to drink a lot during these streams because I talk a lot. So my throat fucking dries up quicker than the Sahara Desert. Like, my god. Still panicked. Dude, I'm just fucking walking, mate. Oh, here we go. In the abyss. Or into the sky, I guess. Into the fucking heavens at this point. Like, how fucking tall is this tower? Like, my god. Oh, you cheeky fucker. Surely I can just fly up. Oh, wait. Can I just... Yeah, there you go. Oh, wait. Can I just throw him off into the fucking abyss? <laughs> I thought I could just throw him into the literal fucking abyss and just be like, be gone. If I put him on top of the books. There you go. Just merge him into the books. That's what he deserves. Oh. They're too nice. Won't fight. I need killers. I need angry brains. Oh. I tweet them. I poke them. I twist them. What do I have to do to make them fight? You just go make yeah, people. Yeah. Try my drill. I'm not gonna bring you any more brains because you're gonna be so mean to them. No matter Aww. what I do. No, no matter what. Not even if I. No, no, not even if I. He's <laughs> turtle soup. Aww. A nice hot turtle soup. I mean, I don't even know if turtle soup tastes that good. I mean, the turtle just doesn't seem like it cares. You sure? The toad just doesn't seem to care. Oh. No, just doesn't care. It's like he was straight up being boiled, and he's just like, "Well, okay, if this happens." Oh. It helps to calm the patients down. Ah, I, I mean, yeah, you're not wrong. When you're stabbing people with needles, you got to have a sense of humor. Oh, it's their two brains. Oh, shit. I need to save the turtle. He got to him. Hi. Oh. We have all that excess skin removed. Igor, that package, General Oleander, please take it up to the holding area and keep it fresh. to stick in my thumb and pull out a block. <laughs> oh, is that what he means for brain? Listen, the man you're working for. I know. I hate him. But if I cook your little turtle from yeah. she your oh. acid situations like this, we'll have to extract Mr. Pokilo. After which, this Lobato character should be pissed because once we get Mr. Pokey up, he always tells me what. You don't listen to him. Uh. Sasha. Oh Mia, God, there they are, both. Billy, all three Dad, of them, brain. Right you came. Of course I did. We gotta get you out of here. Look, the coach must have lured Sasha and Mia here on official psycho. Ah, I see. And then ambushed them with sneezing powder. They're oh, crazy. I see. I know. I saw their brains downstairs. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so glad he showed up. I was just late. He didn't. Uh, ah, get away from me! Stop reading my mind. Oh, I mean, I don't do a birthday cake. Yeah. Sorry about that. God. I don't want to do the birthday cake. Hey, would you mind if I just ate this cake myself? Uh, 
I guess I need to give the cake to someone. Welcome back to the it's just a lot of brain just stored up here, I guess. Yeah, I guess you gotta store the brain somewhere? I don't know if I have every brain yet. I don't know how to check if I have every brain, I'm gonna be honest. Oh god, this thing tips like a motherfucker. This thing is not angry. I guess the planet is technically tipped like this, so that's fair. Got to straighten up the axis of the Earth just for fun. Okay, so I've got to use my telekinesis. Why can't I use my telekinesis on the turtle? Mr. Pokemon, if you could move just under that, then I could lift you. Could you do that? Uh, maybe I need to hold the cake out for it. There we go. As soon as it moves under that hole. Bushka. Booyah. Turtle is mine. I like how he doesn't even bother about me. He's just like, yeah, sure. I guess you're here now. He's very casual about this old fool for a fucking um, evil dentist. Oh, he's got little boots on. Yeah, he's fine. To be fair, I love tortoises. Well, tortoises are so fucking cute. Kill them all. That's right, baby. Oh. Daddy's here. Everything's gonna be all. Oh, this is where Paul and the refs begin. <laughs> You just go pick out like a fucking gun and just shoot the dentist in the teeth. Oh, it's a fake. Wait, are we giving him my brain? Oh shit, we're gonna put the fucking turtle in the tank. They put the turtle brain in a fucking tank. So, did you say they knew I was coming? So I'm guessing I've got to go in here now and wait for him to fucking put the brain into a, a literal fucking tank. Uh, telekinesis. There we go. Uh-oh. It's time to make the soup. Fucking got him. I don't think he's dead. It's whenever villains fall off a tower, they're not dead. Nice and easy. Simple, simple. Hey, we can give him the brain. Hey, they got the brain back. True, I have done it a bit. He knows more about Henry. Really? You know I've been thinking about getting a lab assistant. Sigurd, darling, do you know where all of the Well, if you can lead us to them. Oh, there she goes. Immediately after we break young Miss Donato here out of her restraint. <laughs> There we go. Auto saving point of no return. Ooh, we're on the final mission then. Finally. That thing gave me a tablet. So fully energy's gonna burn. At least you never got inside your brain. It's gonna take me weeks to get my rhythm back. Rasputin, you have surprised us yet again. I cannot thank Exactly, you. I have saved the day. Well, does that mean I'm gonna be day's work for a psychonaut? <laughs> well, Psy Cadet, you mean. Hey, the psychonauts could be so lucky to get someone. Uh oh. All of you for bringing it straight to my door. Is he gonna try and take my brain? You, you took all my <laughs> friends' brains. You turned an innocent fish into a giant monster. You stole all the teachers, derailing my <laughs> education, and you kidnapped my girlfriend. 
Hey! This fight is too big for you. Back home, I had to clean up after the elephants. So oh, me, God. I know how to take care of this ugly little pile. Oh! Uh-oh. Let the grown-ups handle this. You tall people. You tall... <laughs> you tall people. Oh, we're going to have to fight the dentist, I fear. True. When it's official, the genius is back. Time to go get ready for my gallery show. Ah. Oh my god. I guess he was a rat. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Ah, well, that's good. Someone must have turned off the gas long ago. Oh, thank god. Oh no! You better not light a cigarette. Oh, no, I spilled all my turpentine. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no! He got the Molotov. Fuck. Hey, boy! Long time no see. Oh, Mr. Orderly, <laughs> I did not see you there. I was just taking a little therapeutic walk in the moonlight. Relax, the asylum's closed. We can all go home. Leave? Here? Yeah, this place is for crazy people. And I don't know about you, but I ain't crazy no more. Yeah. I have to tell you, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah. Well, maybe it is time for us all to move on. Yeah. What do you think, Floyd? You ready to blow this popsicle stand? Uh-oh. He's going to take that literally. Oh, oh. Oh, he delivered the milk. <laughs> he delivered the milk. The milkman has completed his route. You guys want to split a cab? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. He is literally fucking the milk. <laughs> he has delivered his milk. Oof. What do I have to do to get those guys to take me seriously? When are you oh, going no. to shut up and kiss me? Um, I can hear that. I know. There we go. Uh oh, a bit more of a pressing. I like how everything's burning and they're just not paying attention to it. Oh God, he's here. Bastards. I don't need the psychonauts anymore. I'm making my own army. Got a word for that? Yeah. <laughs> type. Huh? He's gonna make him sneeze the brain out. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. Wow. Wow. Uh oh. <laughs> they kind of caused a fucking nuke with that guy's sneeze. Jesus Christ. Uh oh. That's not good. That's not good at all. Woo! Use your psychic powers. Did he use them? I hope he used them. Or else he just got fucking squished. Okay, good. Don't want to get bloody flattened. Hey! Oh god, the entire place is just gone because of the bug. All of that just led. It just spiraled out of control there. Hey, that was my fight. I was ready for that one. Oh, ah. in such a rush for a student. It takes years before you're ready for combat of that magnitude. To be fair, he's already beaten him before. This one's been acing all my extra credit exams. I beat the coach once already, and I can do it again. Darling, that was just a remote projection of the coach. Oh. He wasn't as strong as he would be if he were to appear in the real world. Uh-oh. Is he going to be in a superhero form? Easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, his brain's going to get put in a tank. Probably stuck in one of his plans to take over the world somewhere. 
It's going to be in the tank. Oh, no. Oh, yep. There it is. Hey, how's the weather down there? Pretty good. Oh, God. It's up to me. Yeah. Yeah. Oof. Uh oh. Yo. Two can play that game. Yeah. True. But only one can win. <laughs> That's actually a pretty good retort. The whole two can play at that game, and then but only one can win. I actually respect that. That is a pretty fun retort. Okay, so he's barricading himself away so that I can't stop him. Okay, so I'm guessing I've got to throw rocks at him? Okay, yeah. Just fucking start absolutely yeeting rocks at him. Oh, I found some fucking poison! Right, I need to sort of... I'm just going to break his general shield so that... Get near the giant psycho blaster death tank. Yeah, sure. I mean, oh wait, shit. I should. Uh, I need to put a uh, shield on my thing. Okay. Right. That was good. 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 Right. I know. What I need to do now. Why can't I? Oh, maybe the metal. Oh, he keeps putting shield shit back. Surprised none of this actually breaks through the wood. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button entirely there. I wonder if I could just keep destroying a shield fast enough if I can just walk up. Oh! Okay, right. So I need to do something with... Do I have any items for killing those? Four. Nope, that didn't work. Uh, let's have a think. Do I have anything? Cobweb duster. Maybe I can, like, grapple it? Right. Do that, do that, do that. Can I grapple it? Oh my god, I keep fucking walking up and then just eating shit. Right. Uh, now. Okay, no, I cannot. Okay, so I need to do something. Because I can't grapple it. Can I just shoot it? No, I cannot just shoot it. Okay. I can burn it. It's wood. It's wood, surely. Surely I can burn it. Uh, yeah. Uh. Yeah, it's wood. Exactly. Ah, fuck. That didn't do anything. Uh, I need... Oh, wait. I can just throw it in. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Now he's going to guard it even more, but I can just incinerate straight away. Why, well, you're not even fucking looking, baby. Oh, God, I keep walking into the fucking poison. Right, I need a shield. I need that fucking health as well. But it's fucking running away from me. God damn it. Run, 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 run. Okay, you can run away from it if you're fast enough. One. Just keep right. Just, just focus on destroying a shield for now. Run, 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 run. Good, 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 good. Just focus on keeping that shield down, and then when you got the opportunity, burn. Run, run, run. Destroy. Get an a shot off. Two. Nice, 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 nice. Three's the charm. Right. So the third. Okay. What is he doing now? Is he just repairing it again? Okay. 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 Good. Focus on just keeping up the destruction while he's repairing it. Walk up, walk up, walk up, and then burn. Running, 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 running. Throw. Break. 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 Run, 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 run. Oh, thank God. This is, uh, this is a pretty fucking intense boss fight. Especially because I fucked up the first half so hard that I lost... Oh, one of those rocks spawned on me. 
Right, I have to get some health back. Like, I just have to. Go, 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 oh, I can't jump until it gets right next to me. Right, I'm, I'm gonna need to, uh... Shield. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I don't need to blast him yet. I just gotta throw rocks at him. Wait for it. Wait for it, wait for it. Okay, good. Go. Go, 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 go. Go over here, go right over here. Get a shot off. Get a shot. Oh, I got lasered. I'm going to have to restart. But thankfully, if I restart, I know how to fight this guy now. And I know I don't need my blast for a long time. All right, run up. Ah, oh, fuck me. I stood too close. All right, shield. Wait, wait, wait. Good. Wait, did I? I'm, oh, I got hit by a rock that fell on me. Come Fucking game. You can actually smash those out of his hand if you're quick enough about it, it seems. Right, now, going for the kill. Go in. Fire. Wait, wait, wait. Shield. Good. Into the thing. Okay, good. First one, first one down. First hit, good. First hit, good. We good, we good, we good. Shield, yep. Build the shield back. Then we just keep on going. We keep on trucking with as much fucking damage as we can. Careful about getting crushed by the rocks because they do spawn fucking on you. Which is a bit annoying, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Right, target. Fire. Shield. Nice. Break. Go. Two down. Problem is going to be the last one where I have to get a blast off on it. I'm going to have to swap from my current abilities to different abilities. Run up. Fire. Good, 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 good. Back off. Shield. Focus on the front and go for it. <coughs> okay, it's, I've just got to shoot it now, I think. Or oh, just one more rock, probably. Get ready to fucking blast that bitch. Brain but Ah! Super. It's easy. No, my brain! No, my brain! Uh oh. TV. TV. No. Oh, this is just great. <laughs> what am I going to do? Oh, I got the brain still thing. Yeah, I mean your brain. Like I got a choice. Exactly. Yeah. Do I have to play? <gasps> oh my god, I'm the brain. Oh, I can telekinesis myself into the tank. I. Oh, I've got to battle the coach and his brain now. Here we go, baby. Into the brain. Into his battlefield. Or is this going to be like a half and half world? Oh, it's him as a kid. My name is Marcel Oleander. But you can call me Maury or Oli. Oh, it's him as a kid. Oh. Coach Oleander? It's both of our mind. Uh oh. Okay, this is a bit weird. Help him destroy the monster inside. Okay. Okay. The circus I remember from my childhood was definitely not made of meat. Yeah. The last time I checked. <laughs> oh God. Rasputin, your journey has made you so much more. Why do you still hoard your goods like a mister? The monster you've scavenged the webs, the cards, the brains, just to redeem them is the remains. Yeah, I don't care. Heck, little Ollie. So I've got to go in and uh, I've got to help him out. Once I grabbed all the figments, of course. 
Ooh, there's a free item over here. Nice. Confusion ammo. I don't want to use confusion, but I'm assuming I might have to use that for this next uh, area. Considering we only used it once, so I feel like it uh, would be slightly better if we could get to like use it a bit more times. Because I feel like it's a bit weird giving us... Oh, hello. Uh, do I have a thing for him? I do not. Hello. Brains redeemed for health. And... Oh, this allows me to just redeem everything here. Cards redeemed. Nice. Oh, this is cool. It allows you to just redeem everything, like, right here. Okay, that's me redeemed everything. I can actually save here as well. All uh, right, I'm going to go quickly grab a drink before we continue on in this uh, well, circus. <laughs> Right, I'll be back in a moment. Right, I'm back. Sorry, I took a uh, slightly bit. That was like four minutes, I think, which is a fair chunk there. Um, I guess now that we're into like actual more level stuff, um, I can actually just talk about some shit. Um, 
you know, a level to actually focus on and shit, you know. Um, the center. Well, first I gotta do this. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Yeah, it's... Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh! Right, so I've got to hold the bunny still. Okay, we got him. We got him straight away. That is a fat rabbit. Oh! Oh, he brought him to another blender. Oh, fuck. Go away, big monster. Fuck off. Um, that's that's one thing I'm thinking of. Uh, oh, God, he's fucking dying up there while I'm trying to collect pigments. Wait, I'm trying to play the game. Oh, no. Go, 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 go. I need to get up there. Go, 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 go. What the fuck are you? Where'd he go? Oh, wait, can I jump on you? Wait, wait, wait. I could jump on you. Oh, I'm coming! Jesus Christ. Uh, funny, I've just been to uh, Psychonauts. I just heard uh, Twitch. Oh, that's really... <laughs> That's pretty convenient. That's pretty good timing then. I respect that. Sometimes it just works. There we go. Take the rabbit. Okay, we good. Oh god, he's fucking pulling up again. And I'm going to have to get up there fast. Because he has like no HP left. Oh wait, no. His HP fully recovered. Okay, thank god. He's not made of paper. Ooh, that was close. I think I'm uh, near the end of the game for Psychonauts, to be fair, so uh, I sh might be able to beat it today. To be fair, I don't know exactly how long it is. All I know is that I saw a speed run. I saw like half of the game in the speed run. To be fair, I'd, I in the speed run, I had only looked at the part of the games that I had played. But after watching all the bits that I had played, it looked like there was only like a few moments left. How the fuck am I going to get... Oh, I see. I need him to throw shit up here. Come on. Throw shit at the thing. There we go. There we go. Let me up. Oh, thank God. Get back here. Die. Creature. No, you don't. Can grab it. <laughs> stop letting him go. No, stop flying higher. You're just going to let him go again and get beaten to death. <laughs> oh my god, you stupid fuck. <laughs> I can't kill him because he's got the fucking stand from JoJo, the fucking lovers, where if I deal damage to one, I deal damage to the other. Wait, is that the right stand? Or is the lover's one where he looks like anything? I don't remember. Right, okay. Oh, perfect. Let's go wait for it to come around now. Go up. Okay. Go! Oh, God! Yes, I made it! Go, 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 go. Holy shit, and he just leapt into the... Oh, oh thank God, game. Jump up. Go, go, go. Jump up. Jump up. Go, 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 go. I'm coming. Go away. Go away. Stay still, rabbit. Oh, thank God there's no death machines there. Jesus Christ. Kid was running from death to death to death. Fuck off. And you too. Oh, you can't kill these guys. Oh! Ah! 
Oh, wait, where the fuck am I going? Oh, I am over here now. Hi. Oh, I've got to do this again. Oh, I wish I could grab onto it as well. That would be nice. Oh, yeah, you can grab onto it at the same time. Nice. Right, we up here. I might as well grab the figments, I guess, while I'm here now. <laughs> I have the time. I can now just, uh, you know, chill. I'm not racing against time anymore. <laughs> we can vibe a bit better. Right. I guess now that I, I, I'm not rushing or anything, uh, I guess the first thing I can talk about, uh, in FF14, I beat Shadowbringers. I beat in the base game. I haven't beaten the uh, patch content yet. That's what I'm going to be going into. Probably later today, I'm going to be honest. Um, ow, that fucking went straight into my fucking spine. Um, but my god. Yeah, I think Shadowbringers is my new favorite expansion. The fucking ending of Shadowbringers. Holy fuck, that's so fucking good. Like, holy shit, that's probably one of my favorite moments. It's my favorite moment in the game, definitely. But it's one of definitely the most memorable moments I've had in video games. Like... I mean, it did only happen recently, so maybe I'll forget in time. But Jesus Christ, was it so... It was... I, I can now basically say Final Fantasy is essentially just anime. Like, no joke. It's essentially just an anime. The entire ending bit is so good. And it's... Oh, my God. I nearly fucking, like... I was straight up on the edge of, like, tears when watching the finale. Oh, I'm not going to make it. Yes, I am. Like, I thought I was going to cry. Like, I don't really... I never really ended up doing it, but I felt like tears. Like, if I wanted to, I definitely could have cried in those moments near the end. Uh, I don't want to spoil anything, I guess. Uh, at some point, I just need to have, like... I feel like once I've done all the patch content, I'll probably do... I'll probably do, like, my full review and stuff, like, uh, with spoilers and stuff once I've done the patch content and I know like the entire story up to date Apparently the patch content it gets even fucking better. So holy shit. I'm looking forward to that uh, Let's really look at this So he's at the beach. He's got he's at the barn got some rabbits. He likes one of the rabbits But of course his dad's a butcher So he needs to kill the rabbit to make food. So yeah, it's a simple thing of like uh, his father's a butcher, but he's a kid, so he likes the pets. And his dad, you know, it's his job. He has to kill him. Oh, no. It's not going to go well for him, I feel. Uh, but my... Yeah, no. All I can say is... Do I recommend FF14? Uh, yeah, if you're looking for a game to play and you have a lot of time. For example, for me, I have a lot of time uh, for it. I have like a, I can commit to a game at the moment because I'm waiting for Elden Ring to come out. I don't have like a bunch of games I'm really like looking to play through. And of course, I, I, I was pretty much off uni for a while. So all I was doing was just learning, like practicing my coding skills. And then I had time to game. And even in my third year of uni, as long as I keep up my course well enough, I should have a lot of... I should still have some fair free time. So, I should still be able to commit to FF14 uh, quite a bit. But, since I had essentially like a big game slot open to commit to, FF14 was just so fucking good. I definitely recommend FF14. Uh, it is pretty much the only MMO... That has actually kept my attention fully. And I've actually been like fully invested in. Like I've played stuff like Netherwinter, Maple Story 2, World of Warcraft, um Fucking I can't remember the other MMOs I've I guess Club Penguin technically. Uh there's another MMO I played, but it's not sticking in my mind. Oh, it was fucking uh it was an MMO called Onigiri. It was about Onis as in like the Japanese demon thing. That was straight up just anime and stuff. I played that for a bit, but... Oh, God! I could not see that. Uh, but I never really committed to that because it, it was very, very... Like, you could tell the game was very rough around the corners. Like, you could tell the game wasn't like... Oh, Jesus Christ! I jumped and I thought it would allow me to carry across, but no, it just fucking flung me into the abyss. Um... Maybe I just don't hit any directions and just let it carry me. 
Alright, I'm just not going to hit any directions and I'm just going to let the game carry me. Not go too fast, because if I go too fast, I don't actually see the fucking big gaps I need to jump. Push a little, push a little, push a little. Careful, careful. Okay, there's an obvious jump. Okay, we good. Take it slow. This isn't fucking Sonic the Hedgehog. To be fair, Sonic the Hedgehog isn't even that fast of a game. It has fast moments, but a lot of Sonic the Hedgehog is like, start, stop, start, stop. Oh, what? It cancelled my second jump. <laughs> right, so I do actually need momentum for certain parts, so I do need to go fast. Okay, never mind. I'm going to hold forward then. We hold forward and we don't fucking let go for anything. I'm just going to have to literally have a reaction time of an instant. Right, pure focus. Full focus. Oh, God. If only I had the fucking echo. Oh, some of these jumps are going to be fucking imp... Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, mm -hmm, that, that, mm -hmm, yeah, okay, yeah, I meant to do that. That was all intentional. That was... That was what the fuck? Where? Hey, little Oli. It's okay. Those monsters are gone now. The bunnies are safe. We're all safe. No, it's not safe. It's coming. Who's who? Dad. Your dad? The butcher? He says little bunnies are good for nothing. Nothing but food. Bah. Here, little bunny. <laughs> oh, God. His dad's on fucking steroids. What the fuck? Okay, uh, maybe not your son. That's a, uh, that's a, uh, that's a bit monkey ass. I'm not gonna lie. Just like, oh, I guess I've got to kill my son now because he won't get let me have the rabbit. Another thing I'm looking forward to soon is the Halo Infinite second flight. I am looking forward to that. Oh god! Right, uh, blast! Ow! Right, can I burn him? Nope, I definitely cannot burn him. Oh, can I? Like... Okay, I don't even know what to do here. What if I jump into the fucking abyss? Okay, that was... I, I don't know what I was thinking. Right, so I'm going to just have to use an ability to kill him. Confusion might be a good idea. I feel like confusion is a good idea. Invisibility? That didn't... Oh, wait. He's, he is confused now, technically. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I can get up him. Okay, so I've got to get him... Confused, then? Because if I confuse him, then he's, his swing is really bad. I just got to get him to uh, swing bad. Oh, I was meant to jump for that one. Just go again to commit to a swing. Okay, good, 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 good. Jump up, jump up, jump up, jump up. Oh, I wasn't quick enough. So it's it's just a matter of avoiding him until he does the big swing. He nearly fucking booted me. Oh, I was gonna jump on that one. Oops. Right, okay, go, 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 go. Oh, no, you have to hit him in the head. You have to hit him in the head, so I have to jump up on him. I'm just gonna fucking use my floaty boy power. Just completely avoid him. And then as soon as he goes for the big cut... Ow! Hunt! <laughs> Come on, big chop. Get up. Go, 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 go. Onto his shoulder. Onto his shoulder. Okay, there's the big slap you want, baby. That's the big slap you want. That's what you want to see. Big chop. What's the next one? Next one is he walks up to you and attempts to kick you. There you go. And then next one's sweep. 
The next one is Big Chop. Boom! Right in the face. You just gonna yeet me out of there? Honestly, respectable. You just threw us into the fucking meat cavern. Jesus Christ. This is like the flood. Who the fuck is that? What have you done to our circus? Oh, is that my dad? Dare my characters, yep. Perverted. This looks like the work of mentalists. I can Mentalist. explain. Have you been associating with psychics? Jesus They're Christ, my character's psychics. dad looks like a pirate. Fortune tellers. They killed your grandfather. They cut... Yes, but... Let's see. Oh, is he going to, like, challenge me to do all What's the circus stuff? Be, son? Show me what you got. Yeah, it's why I'm good at doing gymnastics. It's because my character is, of course, a gymnast. By all technicalities. Like the butcher, already done. So now I've just got to beat up my father. Just beat my the shit out of him. Uh-oh. We need to speed parkour, baby. Uh, where do I go from here? Uh, I need to, I need to jump over here and then walk across here. What's from here? What's from here? Where do I go from here? Oh, I just need to keep going higher and higher, baby, until I hit the fucking moon. Really, game? Really, game? <laughs> it just goes, nah, that doesn't count. <laughs> nah, you, 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 you clipped through it. That doesn't count. To be fair, this is an old game, so hitboxes weren't exactly well designed. Grab, 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 grab. That one worked. Just a simple tap jump. That's all you need. Oh my god, I thought I fell through the gap. Oh, I... Oh, 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 oh. I broke the game. One second, let me just look. <laughs> I actually broke the game. I actually was too fast for the fucking game and broke it. Oops. Sorry, game, that I'm too good for you. <laughs> game was like, nah, mate, you're too good. We're gonna have to fucking kill you. Did I? I mean, I don't think Cat should really involve... Right, wait for him to jump. Do not actually take the swing before him and break the game. I'm just going to go over here. This seems like an interesting path instead. There's multiple paths, it seems. Nope, stop swinging. Stop swinging. You literally have no momentum. Why are you swinging? Go, 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 go. Go, go, go back, go back, go back, go back. Go, 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 go. Oh, wait, he's throwing him straight now. Nope, he's throwing jump. No, he's throwing straight. I'm very confused to say it. Don't, 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 don't. Holy shit, that went very fucking. Oh, 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 I'm on the inside. Why am I on the inside now? Okay. Yep, I, this is, this is all, okay, perspective. I mean, actually, you know what? No, this is much better perspective. Uh, where now? Do I have to fucking jump through that? Oh, God. Whoop. Whoop up. Through the ring. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's actually throwing projectiles at me while I do this. This is not good.
Oh my god, that was so fun. Right, we're saving. There's no way I'm not saving while I'm up here this far. No fucking way. Oh god, this is gonna be a thing. Oh, that cut close. Quite literally, if you get what I mean. Oh wait, they throw... Okay. Can I even, um, use my shield here? Oh, that's a ladder and a half. Oh, this is not really a ladder, is it? The water's coming! Sink or swim, bitch! Yes, I can hear you, Mr. Ghost Man. I don't know what you fucking want from me. Oh, I'm guessing this whole ladder is meant to be like, oh no, the water's coming fast. You better go. Oh, this is, I just realized we're in a massive fucking rib cage, which is slightly unsettling. Only slightly. I'm going to save as soon as I get up here because there's no fucking way I'm not saving. I can just jump off here like, what the fuck? Dad, I made it. You yep. Cheated. No, I use the acrobatics you taught me. Don't yep. lie to me, cheater. You're no. I mean, isn't that a good thing? Oli, are you okay? He's over there talking to you. He did what? Uh -oh. Somebody's going to get drowned. Make that round. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna have to fight both. One's got, he's got flaming axes now. Uh, let's definitely save. <laughs> right, okay, let's go, I guess. But surely I've just got to do what I did before, except for... Oh shit, he was way faster that time. Okay, just gotta keep on moving. Oh, I walk straight for. Oh, I'm so dead. I am so dead. Oh, but I can't. Fuck, I'm not fast enough. Ow! I got fucking. I got slapped. Right, okay, we're gonna have to fucking. We're gonna have to dance with this guy now. We're gonna actually have to fucking dance with this guy and pay attention. I did. Oh, I can't touch his axes. I just remembered. Oh, shit. I can, um... Yeah, no, no, no. Thank you for saying catch those. Just remembered. That's a whole... That's a fucking mechanic. Uh, shield. Right, shield. Right, good, good, good. And then... Telekinesis this into him. Oh, I'll oh, see. I can knock him down and then fucking slap him in the head. Aha! Go, 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 go. Oh, fuck. Wait, wait, wait. I've got to get closer. Got to get closer. Got to get one. Throw it right in his knee. Throw it right in his fucking knee. Throw it right in his knee. Right in the dick. Boom! Right in the face, dickwad. Pay attention to the ground, but also pay attention to the guy literally fucking following you. Alright. Oh, fuck me. Get up close. And right in the face. Into the sores of your bitch, boy. You shall become what you hated. Oh, it's my actual dad. Unconscious people. What have you gotten yourself involved in? How do you get here? Oh, because they turned to pick me up.
I used my psychic connects with his eyes. I will project myself into your mind. But how can you beat me for being psychic if you're psychic too? Oh, I could never hate you. I only wanted you to be happy, Rascal. Oh, he didn't want it to be because his parents are psychic. Our family has many enemies. Oh, I see. Oh. I have a lot more hair than that. Now see, we have to carefully unweave your psyche from that of the brain. Ah. Anything bad can happen while your mind is in the Yeah, exactly. State. The damage could be permanent. Mhm. Mm oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck. Oh, he's gonna juggle his axes. True. He's gonna give me a psychic energy. Oh, here I go. Am I gonna, like, grow up? Or am I just gonna get really big? Yeah. Big mode. Oh, it's go time, but he's scared now. Right, save. And, yeah. Right, so now this is going to be a fucking... Boom, baby! Right, so I need to... I'm guessing it's a matter of I need to wait for my bigness to recharge while avoiding. Yeah. Wait for my bigness to return. I don't know how to trigger it. Okay. Whoa! 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 Fuck! I was so close to getting another hit off. Right, run, 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 run. I am effective at running. I am a coward. I am a coward. I'm a coward. <laughs> I know how to run very effectively. Big mode. Boom. Urgh, fucking. Urgh. Uh oh. Go, 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 we good, we good, we good. Just keep on running from the monstrosity. But again, like, as I said, this is... This very much doesn't seem like a, a kid's game. Because it seems definitely very much more teenager because of just how fucking... Like, this is a... Like, the man got shoved in a blender and has now become a monstrosity. I feel like that's very, uh... It's definitely not for kids. I mean, it's a bit cartoony, but it's definitely, like, not folly. With all the, like, staples and shit holding them together. Like, if this was in high graphics, like, that thing would look terrifying if this had like really hd graphics uh oh the brain is deframbulating Whee. oh yeah that's another thing they had the playstation showcase where there was zero interesting i mean we saw a bit of the next god of war but i don't have a playstation so it means nothing to me Ugh. no more no more He's happy now. There you go. Good little bunny. <laughs> the fat oh, rabbit now. Thanks for helping me save the bunny. And for talking to my dad. No probs. No problem, little Ollie. Bye bye. Wave goodbye, Mr. Bun. <laughs> Where's he going? Oh, I thought he was actually gonna You're wave. Separating the brains now, Rascal. Yeah. He'll be fine. Let's go inside. Man, I can't wait to tell you about all the but messed up stuff that happened. Oh, I know a lot of it. <coughs> While you were out, I poked around a bit. Tell me about this lily person. Ooh. <laughs> and so that brings yeah. us to the end. Oh, is he telling the tale? You can clearly see the personal demons causing my negative behavior have all been eradicated, leaving me sane once again. Ah. This is also corroborated in CAT scan number three on page 59 of your handout. Oh, there you go. 
just like to reiterate how extremely, extremely sorry I am for stealing all of your brains and trying to take over the world. Yeah, you know, it happens. Yeah, but this can't stuff be happens. All about education. And I know I, for one, learned plenty. Thanks yeah. to that guy right there. Come on up here, Raz. Yeah. We endeavor to build strong minds. What's that, Christanium? Big rock. Oh, he's, oh, that's how he has his powers. Burn things. But <laughs> it's a Burn special things. quality of your heart, not your mind, that truly makes a great psychonaut. Oh, that's how he's walking around is with his rock. We did not give it to him. We got it from someone else long before he came here. Hmm. But we <laughs> can give him this to honor his mind. Oh, a psychonaut. Uh, jacket. We do not normally ask this of someone so young, but it is obvious to us yeah. that you are not average. Will you join us, Rasputin? Yes. Will you be a psychonaut? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A full psychonaut. He doesn't have his head anymore. Boom! Psychonaut badge. I guess that little bit at the end then sort of forces you to unlock everything, I guess. Oh, now the parking lot actually gets shown off. I was about to say, we never went to the parking okay. lot, really. Let's be perfectly clear about this. That was Yo, look at him. He's got a fucking style now. Well, he's a psychonaut now, so they'll meet again. Bye. Oof! Is he gonna go for it? Hey! Good job, Raz. Children, it's an emergency. There's been another kidnapping. I was here the whole time. You saw me. <laughs> I know who it is, and that's what scares us. Who was kidnapped? Truman Zanotto. The grand head of the psychonauts. Uh oh. Dad. Sir, can you teleport this many of us back to headquarters? Huh? What? Hey, hey, what are all you people doing in my kitchen? Oh, his fucking citation ran out. I'm guessing this leads into Psychonauts 2 then? That is a fun jet, actually. Really, really proportion. To be fair, this entire we'll game. Yes, after all, we'll have Rasputin helping us. Yeah. Now, how could we do this without our anti-kidnapping specialist? Not a great title, but it is one. I've talked to everything I can, son. Now, you go show them. Show them all. Hey, his father does approve and everything. Nice. Let's go. Hell yeah. Oh, why can't I fly yet? Bruh. I can only levitate. I can't fly yet. I mean, you can if you know the glitch, but that's besides the point. Oh, it flies just via Citanium and Telekinesis. That's... Yeah, I mean, honestly, that works. There you go. Psychonauts. That's... Yeah. That was a good game. There was some dodgy platforming, but I feel like the dodgy platforming mainly just comes from, you know, its time period. Uh... Of course, this, they, back on the PlayStation 1 where they probably didn't have, like, everything completely figured out. Oh, he's got his rabbits. Um, but yeah. No, that was a good game. Uh, for platformers, uh, this definitely gave me some Hat in Time vibes. Of course, Hat in Time came out. I feel like Hat in Time must have taken some inspiration from this because they both had, like, instead of, like, focusing on being really technical platformers, or, like, very much, instead of fully focusing on the platforming where stuff like Mario does... They instead just focused on the writing and the characters, which uh, I quite enjoy, honestly. Uh, as much as, like, fun and free platforming is really nice, uh, I feel like fun and free platforming can only go so far, whereas having good character and, like, well, not even, like, 
you don't need deep characters, but fun characters and fun in varying environments definitely stick in your head a lot longer. Like, each level in this game had was completely different. Like, they all had different vibes, wherein other platformers, a lot of levels have, like, similar vibes. Um... And I feel like that that helps make games really stick in your mind more because you get all of this variety. Um, especially after playing like FF14, which has some really good environments, but there is God knows how many deserts in that game. Like, Jesus Christ. Um, but yeah, his brain's fine. Um, but yeah, no, uh, I quite enjoyed this. Uh, when will I be playing Psychonauts 2? Probably not for a while because uh, it, it's at full price at the moment be paying it at full price mainly because i've got money i want to spend on other stuff but you know when that game goes down in price at some point i will definitely buy it because this game was good and but well, it's a sequel so uh it'll be quite interesting to see where the story goes as with raz as a psychonaut or if it's like a re i'm pretty sure it's a sequel because it's psychonauts but yes um thank you for uh Thank you for watching this stream, to be fair. I probably will just end the stream after this because we've gone on for a decent enough time, to be fair. It's not the full two hours, but I genuinely don't think I have enough time to really start up a new game. Um, I'm the opening. Uh, if we had like an hour left, I would have started up a new game because an hour is a decent chunk of time. But like we have like 20 ish. So I feel like I'm going to call it here. Uh, but I guess I can sort of talk about some of the other stuff now that the, well, the credits just play. Um, so another thing, I've been watching some old Gmod videos on YouTube, and my god, do those take me back. Not like the old Gmod trolling stuff, but like uh, Bed Banana stuff, uh, where they sort of did their own little narratives and stuff. And it's funny, it's very, it's very weird seeing old YouTube where anything, everything was a lot more, like there was less editing and stuff, but... It, there, there, it was it had that it has that charm of like lower production value of like it generally just feels like people are pissing about having fun which has lost which has sort of been lost a bit because a lot more videos these days are a lot more we're well, not high production per se but they have a lot more editing they're really clean and stuff like bad like issues are just edited out and stuff and as much as that is better content it does lose some of that charm which is i feel like the reason why a lot of people like vtubers because a lot of vtubers just casually stream and it very much has some of that old youtube vibes of just people pissing about instead of trying to make like the best content they can both ways are perfectly fine but i i do enjoy having the mix and having some of that old charm back uh, of course, Balloon Tower Defense 6, I've been playing that a fair bit of my own time. I may do a stream of that at some point, because it's a fun game. But for me, Balloons isn't really, I don't think, a game I'll sit down and play for like two hours. I normally just sit down, do a few rounds, come off. Because it's very much for me, it's a jump in, jump out game, which uh, I, I enjoy about it. That's why I play it. Um, so I might do like a bit of a stream on that, but uh, probably not for now. Uh, the Steam Decks coming out in December, I think. I probably will buy that, honestly. Just because, why, like, it's a Switch, but with all my Steam games. Like, holy shit, that's just really fucking good. Like, you can't even complain about that. That's just, that's just cool as fuck. Um, PlayStation Showcase. Uh, I don't really think there was much. They, they had the God of War, of course. I did miss the beginning bit of the trailer. There was a straight up, like, Devil May Cry anime game. Well, I guess more Bayonetta with, like, a skin-tight suit. Uh, lady, uh, just chat was just fucking humming up. Um, I didn't really see anything that was announced. Uncharted, I think, is coming to PC, which is cool, honestly. I'm ha the only reason I care about like stuff like Uncharted and Horizons coming to PC is because it's showing that Sony is okay with slowly bringing stuff to PC because they know at this point that those games probably won't sell anymore on sony consoles because they things have pretty much had their time so re-releasing them on pc will get them more sales and stuff uh i'm hoping they'll fucking do bloodborne at some point if sony does ever release bloodborne on pc i'm doing a playthrough of it of course uh, like a hundred fucking percent but we've got to wait for that to hopefully happen Ooh, maybe they'll release the demon souls remaster on pc at some point once they've got enough but to be fair they probably won't do that for a while because they're still selling the playstation 5 so they probably want to wait for that that's not gonna happen for like another six years until playstation 5 dies off um 
but yeah, I'm hoping for a Bloodborne on PC because that'd be really nice. Um, other than that, they've got the Halo Infinite Flight coming soon. Uh, depending on when it's out, I'll probably do a stream on it, hopefully, because I'm I really want to play Halo Infinite. Because if you don't know, I'm a Halo fan. So uh, I'll like, hey, look, it's uh, double fine. That's cool to see. Um, yeah, I'll probably be doing that. Um, yeah, that's Psychonauts. Uh, I think that's fine. Ross already. I can't really think of anything from the PlayStation Showcase. Let's actually go to the away screen now. Uh, now that we've sort of done that, I can't really think of much that really stuck out to me from the PlayStation Showcase. Um, we I don't, like. But having a Marvel Wolverine, and Jesus Christ, I don't know why they're releasing so many Marvel games. Like, Mar Marvel Spider-Man, a lot, that was good. Then they re-released it again, which I think was a bit lazy, but of course they found a really good game, so they're just going to re-release it, essentially. Um, <clears throat> we're getting... was it? The Marvel Avengers game came out. I'm pretty sure that game must have done poorly, because I didn't fucking see anything about it. <clears throat> and then it got DLC... And I still haven't heard anything about the game, so I'm assuming that'll go well. Guardians of the Galaxy <clears throat> would have been a fine game. It looks like a fine game, but they keep fucking showing it. And that's just killing everyone's interest for it because of the fact they just keep going, hey, look, we're releasing this game. And people are just like, yeah, we get it. We don't care. Um, the more you show off a game to people who don't care about it, like... If the response to your game is, oh, this looks all right, don't keep showing it because that's just going to kill all interest for it. Showing it over and over again does not make more people interested. Um, fucking, uh, I don't, Elden Ring, we didn't get anything of, sadly, even though YouTubers have gotten, like, gameplay previews, but they probably don't, they showed it to the YouTubers to essentially... In, get hype essentially you build up hype and then they'll release the full gameplay trailers uh hopefully at some point before the game comes out uh, which is not too far away at this point um i don't remember there's the fucking gran turismo but all car games look the same to me um can't think of it. It, it it was quite boring to be honest there just wasn't anything there for me uh i've never really been like a big sony fan so uh I've never really been like sort of like waiting for those big Sony games. I don't know, even know if they have any like big Sony. Alright, uh, the next New Horizons game, I guess. But that game doesn't look too interesting. It looks beautiful, but it's just Assassin's Creed, so I I don't really care. Um, yeah, they just didn't really have anything that really caught my attention. I don't really think I have anything else to talk about. Uh, hopefully, by the time I beat Shadowbringers pre uh, patch content, I'll be able to have my full. I'll probably have like an entire stream talking and just about my opinion on FF14, like the story, the different expansions, complete with spoilers and everything. I just want to make sure I have all the content done before I start speaking, because I might be like, "Oh, I don't know if this happens," and then it might just happen, meaning my entire point was just useless because it's not like i'm doing a playthrough of it it's very much i'm playing through my time and then speaking about it uh but yes uh i hope you did enjoy the stream uh for my next playthrough i have no fucking clue i've got some ideas and one of them i might commit to uh i guess we'll just see uh but i hope you lot had a good one uh you lot stay safe stay hydrated and uh see you next time on wednesday have a good one